Hey everyone, this is Greg from Chemical Guys, and today I'm gonna to show you exactly how to dilute your detailing products so you can get the best result on any job. Now there's two types of products, ready to use and concentrated. Now a lot of our products at Chemical Guys are actually concentrated, and that means that they can be diluted. So what is dilution? Dilution means that you take your product and you mix it with water to actually water down the product to get the right ratio so it works properly. Now that's a lot better for you as a detailer or as a consumer because because when you buy a product, we ship it to you concentrated and we're not shipping you water. That means we can ship you more product in a smaller bottle and then you can dilute it on the job. Now dilution ratio is really complicated for some people and a lot of people don't understand it. So we spent the time to make this awesome dilution ratio chart. Now this gives you all the dilution ratio measurements in ounces for any type of container that we sell here at Chemical Guys. So we made one for a 16 ounce, a 32 ounce, one gallon and five gallon and we gave you all the ounce dilution ratios from one to one all the way from 128 to one. Now this is going to be a great tool to help you dilute your products and make sure you have the right ratio to clean any type of job. Now dilution ratio can be a little complicated so I'm going to break down and show you how it works. Now dilution ratios are usually set up with two numbers with a colon right in the middle. Now those two numbers may be anything from 4 to 1 or they may be as high as 64 to 1. Now what this means is that you're mixing, let's say we're talking about 10 to 1, you're mixing 10 parts water with one part product. So the bigger number is actually the water and the smaller number is the amount of product that you're mixing in your bottle. Now every size bottle is different so you need to do the math to get the right result and the right dilution for that size bottle. So for an example, let's show you how to dilute a 16 ounce bottle 3 to 1. So if you have 16 ounces, just like here, you can easily take that number 16 and use that as your base to find out the calculation. So what we do is we take our number 3 to 1, which is our 3 parts water to 1 part concentrate, and we add those together. So 3 plus 1 equals 4. Now we take the size of our container, 16 ounces, and we take 16 ounces and divide it by the number that we added up together. So that'd be 16 divided by four. Now 16 ounces divided by four is four ounces. Now once we have that number, or four ounces, that means that that is our number for our one parts. So we take our bottle and we can actually put four ounces of our cleaner or our any type of detailing product in the bottle. That's our one part. Now to get the ounces for the three parts, what we do is we take 16, which is 16 ounces, the size of the bottle, and we minus or subtract our one part, which is our four ounces. So 16 minus four equals 12. That 12 ounces is the amount of water that we put in the bottle to get the right ratio. So 12 plus four equals 16, and that fills up a full 16 ounce bottle. Now you can do this calculation for any type of size. You could do it for a one gallon, which is 128 ounces, or you can do five gallons, which is 640 ounces. And you can use this for any type of size in between, but we set it up on our chart for our four bottle sizes that we sell here at Chemical Guys. Now, if you don't know how to do math or math is a hard subject for you, you can easily go ahead and use the chart by finding the number that you wanna place the dilution ratio at. So if you have 16 ounces at eight to one, that means you add 1.8 ounces of product to 14.2 ounces of water. It's super easy to do and it makes diluting any product quick and easy. Now I'm gonna show you how to dilute the product in a bottle. So we're gonna do this one uh, three to one using 16 ounce bottle of all clean. Now dilution ratio can be done in any type of ratio. We give you recommendations for the specific types of dilutions, but if you wanna dilute your product 10 to one, you can easily do that. If you wanna do it four to one, you can do that too. You can adjust your dilutions to the job it need. So if I'm using all clean right here, which recommends that I dilute it 10 to one or 20 to one, I can use it maybe to clean something stronger and dilute it three to one to get even more cleaning power. So I have an empty 16 ounce bottle right here and I have it fitted with the easy, the perfect pour easy fill funnel. Now I'm gonna screw my funnel on just so I don't spill any product and I'm gonna dilute this three to one. So what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna di divide it by the added numbers, three to one, three plus one equals four. So that means I'm gonna do this in quarters. So I'm gonna fill the bottle up with all clean one quarter of the way. There we go, that's about a quarter. Now I'm gonna take my water, this is just regular, clean, distilled water. 
and I'm going to dilute my product with the other three parts. Now this gives me a good ratio of 3 to 1. Now look, you notice I didn't spill any product because of my perfect pour funnel. And if I want to fill it just up to the top, I can get the right dilution. There we go. Now our product is ready to go. I can, all I got to do is add a sprayer and I can go detailing. Now dilution ratios is super simple and that's why we spent the time to make this chart just to help you guys so you can dilute any of your products in any size bottles. So you can make a one size gallon if you want to make a one gallon or if you want to make a five gallon square you can easily take all of your product make five gallons of products and be using that ready to use solution anytime you want. Now I'm going to put the link to this chart right in the description box of this video and maybe I'll put the link to a clickable link right here on the screen so that means you can easily grab the chart print it out you can put it in your garage you can put it in your shop or if you're a mobile detailer you can have it in your van ready to use whenever you need it so that way your dilution ratios are easily done quick and easy just by using this chart and we spend a lot of time to make this chart really high quality so you can print out a big version and place it in your shop along with our detailing flow chart or any other information that you can get right off our YouTube channel and our website to help you detail faster and easier. So hope you like the information. Check out our YouTube, our Facebook, and our Instagram for more information about Chemical Guys and the awesome educational footage that we put right here on our YouTube channel. But always remember to have fun, stay clean, and keep on detailing.